Good afternoon, our alchemy. <clears throat> Sorry about that. So I I brought I am doing the second uh second haul second birthday haul. So I got everything and a couple of extra things, but I am missing uh one more small packet of like brushes that the that I got from Jackson's as well. I ended up doing three separate um very small uh what is it uh um well i bought three different items and they were one after the other um i originally started with this is Goda set travel set and then the next day i ended up getting um something else actually it wasn't the escoda it was uh it was uh uh, the professional 12 uh, watercolor set I remember I bought for Christmas to give away I brought the professional travel the little um, the little tiny one that um, plastic one so it was on sale but I actually wanted just the watercolors <laughs> so I took out the watercolors I swapped them for the cotton remember the cotton cotton man set that I had got um, well I I swapped those for for the cotton man and I gave them away for Christmas with the professional travel um travel like the little the little tiny uh set set of um um with the little water jug and all that you you all know what i'm talking about and uh i swapped them because i i remember how i got this why well, i ended up swapping these for the professional one and i put them in here and because i really like this little compact um um uh the tin so and I and the fact that it was white and not black was better. So I ended up buying twelve more for my birthday. They were on sale, um, half pants. So it'll be now twenty four. So that's the reason that I did the first um, order at Jackson's, and then I ended up getting this because I found out that it's Coda travel um, the travel uh, brushes were on sale, and they were. And then, then I found another video, which is, which is, uh, I'm going to do a, that separate video because they're not here yet. I think it's on its way. And because of the holiday tomorrow for Martin Luther, I won't probably get it till uh, Tuesday um, through the postal mail. So that'll be, that is like a separate brush set. They're not travel set. It's a regular pair by, um, by this german um watercolor artist and i found that video when i already had these two packages on the way and that was like around right after the new year and for my birthday and um as you can see things arrive in the same birthday week <laughs> but after and um and uh, by the way this is jackson's um new package which i'm glad i'm gonna move this for a little bit see as you can see because of all the problems that I had, and I'm sure I wasn't the only one, that um, uh, over the holidays that were, where the U.S. Customs were holding, because they all they wanted was this. So I was like, I wonder why they don't put this little sticker. So they actually did, and it, and now and this is free shipping. I think um, if you order like a couple of things and this not really heavy, they actually won't charge you to ship it. It does take a couple like maybe four days more but it comes from sweden straight to uh, jfk and i blocked out my mailing but yeah this is in the, i love how they put this happy unboxing so this was one of them and then i threw away the box which was identical to this label um and then the other one um, it's not here yet so i'm assuming it's going to be something like this as well but that is so cute so that makes it so much run through u.s customs so uh fast um and yeah because it's already everything that they want to know it's already it's out and they even put that they have permission to open the packet and i'm glad that they don't because this there's nothing glass here but when jackson you know how when jackson sends something with glass they tend to wrap everything like a lot and if customs u.s customs open would open that they probably wouldn't rewrap them carefully the same way and it's probably things would get broken so i'm glad that they created this label and they don't have to open anything basically when i my stuff over pre-black friday was um when they um uh, 
when they grabbed it they basically told me that um, when they scan it uh, because of all the extra wrapping because I had stuff that it was glass and stuff that it would break um, like big sets of watercolors and stuff like that um, they needed that like recycle wrapping like how Jackson does it they just when they would scan it it wouldn't show what it is so they were wary and that was the only reason they were holding that first packet the second and their packets and all these little ones just run it run through and fast but i'm really glad that they did this and i hope some of you also in the u.s that they you got free shipping recently because they started doing free shipping um after christmas which i was really happy about because i mean 14 dollars you know fedex does here get here two or three days but in three days on the exact three day after it ships i mean it's still you save it's a lifesaver so anyway i'm gonna show you that in a minute but let me show you so i grabbed two things and i got them earlier today thank god um so i don't have to wait on all of them all day through um through amazon so because i was waiting on this i ended up getting um this little mimic travel set from and it comes like this and uh, i took the it, it comes this uh, mimic uh squirrel pocket brush um i hope you all can see it they're either you could watercolor wash or clicks mine are just going to be for watercolors and it has these brushes uh round size two four six eight and a flat and i got this because there was 24 dollars 22 on jerry or rama but i got them through the jerry's uh the jerry uh amazon which is 24 dollars because i wanted them fast and i didn't want to buy anything extra so i like this little this is vegan by the way it's synthetic squir squirrel um so this is a vegan uh pouch and it's um kind of like a faux leather um it's really nice and what's the best thing about this that it was like this already like it has a little velcro which i really like and it has the four brushes but it came like this so i'm glad i think you could put like a little pad or something because it has this little extra thing so but yeah i just wanted to show you guys um the brushes so it comes obviously five and these i bought them because a they're cheap and um i wanted something see it has this says mimic flat it has to i don't know if you can see it on camera um they're gold and it has the size as well the size what it is and then the name um which that's really helpful and then it's really easy let's see it's really easy to hold them and stuff and i have small hands so this is really nice um so these are going to be like for like local tr like travel and stuff like kind of like my not um not pricey type um brushes and I wanted to try a few trouble see this is the round um yeah and this is it they are nice and i mean for that amount of money i heard a lot of good things through uh um about these brushes um through lindsay wyrich the frugal crafter she has this set um before she created like her own um and she uses them religiously. She has the normal brushes, not, like not the travel set. And but these look almost identical, like from here out. And uh, yeah, that's the reason um, I wasn't too thrilled with. Like I didn't want really, really cheap travel brushes. Like I mean, I don't have nothing against brushes, but if I can help it, I don't want to buy them like over and over. I have. Um, and this is the other one like the liner uh, yeah this is also a number two round but it's very small and uh, so for details but I didn't want to like I said I don't want to spend like too much money on them now I'm trying to find like quality now that I've been a year in to see kind of which brushes I like and which are better oh and by the way as we speak um, the Cassin, Ca, no, no, Da Vinci. The ones that I'm getting are Da Vinci by Oliviera. 
um, like I said, uh, and it's a dual set, um, Oliveira Rabbi or something like that. Um, and um, they're regular brushes, and then I got two extra that they were on clearance and they were super cheap just to try. But um, uh, they are Da Vinci, that's the reason that I, I grabbed the video from a watercolor artist from Thailand, Jay. And I guess they, they were on like during after Christmas. They were on sale and it was like $22, but I got them for like on like around $22, 23 because I had a $2 off and then I bought something. I added two more things, the two very inexpensive brushes. Oh, and uh, before I get into this one, into the Escoda, let me unbox it. So I got this um, too because I was, I wanted this for the holiday. So this is not as it seems. Um, I guess Sennelier changed. So this is the... Um, the metallic version see i and i was about to get mad but it does say iridescent so we're gonna open them now and see if that's true because i already have the uh the, the introductory set i even have the trial introductory set um so yeah and i really like these pastels but i i, I you know how i love metallics um oh but <laughs> Sorry about the. I'll tell you about the brushes about the Da Vinci. I went off on a tangent, so let me show you this, and then when I hit get the Escoda brushes, I will let you know. Oh, this is hard. Um, I will let you know what. Uh, um. Well, let me tell you now when I'm open this. So yeah, the uh, Rabia Oliveira. That's how I found out about the uh, the brushes. So go on Jax's now and just uh and check if you guys are looking for good quality brushes um da vinci sets or like sets and they will show up because uh da vinci the five um with the wooden box it's cheaper than this in the escoda then and it's regular brushes i couldn't believe it um and they sold out and they i think they're now they're back so um on stock and yeah and it's like 53 or 54 dollars for let me see well guys i think they look the exact same so i'm gonna have to call them and let them know that they send me the wrong wrong set because they look they don't oh they look uh they don't look iridescent to me. Mm. See, and they look kind of small too. It's supposed to say iridescent, or because they, I mean, from just an angle, they look identical to yeah, lemon yellow. Yeah, they're not iridescent. They're I don't know why they mislabel them. They're supposed to be the iridescent normally comes with with uh, black, black, and this one is not. And I was hesitant to open them, so I'm like really disappointed. I'm gonna have to call Amazon and see why they are mislabeling the uh, the products because I already have this introductory set and I don't need another one. I need I want the um, yeah the iridescent. Mm -hmm. that is really bad on their part that they're and online it said iridescent so when i bought them because they're good quality and i wanted the iridescent not the regular set i already have the regular set they're really nice but i yeah so as you can see, even see, I think maybe their labeling is incorrect because it says on there, see, iridescent, but it's not iridescent, it's regular, regular oil pastels. So I'm going to, yeah, I hate when Amazon does that, but I guess it's not entirely their fault. Okay, moving along because, yeah, this is taking me forever and i've been talking 
I've been talking <laughs> for a while. So let me, so this is the Escoda set. Um, I wanted this, I wanted a good quality travel set. So um, there was a, a, a woman from, she has a YouTube channel um, from Canada. Uh, Jax is her last name. I forget, Jacqueline, I think, Jacqueline Jax. And she made this uh, video. So there's, this is a black set, but there's a red set, there's a blue set. And there's a green set, a blue, uh, yeah, blue, red, um, green, and black. And there's another black that is cheaper than this one. But I got this one because I, w I wanted a, like a flat one and I wanted to try this one, which is the dagger. And then it has this one. This one blew me away. This is, uh, so they're different. So let me show you. This is the number 16 and I'll open them and show it to you. This is number 16. Uh, versatile and uh, uh, one and a half is called a perla and 12 inch uh, perla and you know these are they're they're all synthetic and uh, yeah these are white and this is brown so this is my really good this is my first set of Escoda brushes ever Escoda they as you know they're from Spain and it's they're they're really pricey they're like that Issa Bay because um, they're made, they're handmade and um, handmade everything uh, from from a place near Barcelona, but not in Barcelona. It's closed. So yeah, I heard a lot of good things um, about this, and like I said, it was only a couple, of, like around ten dollars more than the um, the U.S. Uh, Neptune ones, which I don't have nothing against. Since I love, I have two Neptune brushes and you know which I'm really really happy about that I acquire they're no more brushes but I just like I said um I wanted a really good quality that it was gonna last me in a long time and like I said the Escoda regular brushes are really expensive so they come out in this really nice and they're packaged really really well as you can see me um this one has a little bit so it's tightly it's more tight than the um, Mimic um, and it's as you can see a little bit bigger as well they're both pocket but I'm feel on this one I feel like I could put a little a little tiny notebook that I could create on this one no but it this one has this uh, this one does not but this one has like extra so I opened them just to see them and I was so excited to do this video for you and oh my gosh look at the 18 I think this is 16 oh my god it's so nice and it's so big look at that it's and this is it's dry right now so you can imagine how big it really is and it's when you put it together it doesn't feel like a travel brush it feels like a normal brush it's really high quality Jackson Jacks from um, on YouTube said that and she's from Canada, you know, so she was like, she bought out like three sets or maybe the four sets. Um, I don't remember, but I do remember that she said that they were super good quality and they really are. I expected them to be like, I thought they were smaller, like maybe this size. And no, when you put them together and see, they even snap really, really well. They're in the, the fact that they, they went down in price because normally they would be a hundred and hundred and like forty dollars. So it's not hard. I just kind of because they're new. I have to, and this is kind of like slick. I have to. The only difference is that the mimic squirrel has the mimic squirrel lettering here and what they are, and this one does not. So Skoda, you need to <laughs> upgrade your thing. Um, that's the only thing, because other than that, like I said, it feels like, and this is the reason that I got it because of this brush, the dagger. I don't have a dagger at all, so this this will be my first dagger. And the other one, the regular brush set that I got from Da Vinci, the one that's on its way, it has a, like an, another, like the little spider, I called it the spider. It's a really long um, tail end brush, and, and it has the, um, and that one has a mix between synthetic and regular like two kinds of animal hair they're make it's a mixed brush but um you know i i'm not vegetarian or anything 
I love pork, but I don't need much of the other stuff. So, I and mean, I'm sorry for the animals. But yeah, I do get I do tend to get synthetic because I like the spring back. But uh, yeah, so that's my um, Escoda travel set black. And like I said, I got them from Jackson. But like I said, this is super affordable. So have I not have this not been on sale, I would have bought this and I would have probably waited on this probably to the summer. So now what else did I get from Jackson? Well, I already um, told you, but I'm going to show it to you. Oh, yeah, I, uh, I got this for two dollars. The um, Sane Cutter Mill, I mean, Sane Cutter's Mill. I said that in one by mill um paper so i thought it was a little bit bigger i'm gonna put them on a on the sketchbook thing but it's for watercolor gouache acrylic and pencil i like that it has all these little things try me one two three four i think there's six pieces or there may be more uh yeah so in this one you could obviously um Put that on here i don't like when them i like it when they don't they just leave that on one side and not both but yeah but uh, so i thought i'd give it a try i like to, when it when i when i purchase something from jackson if i can i try to get some sort of paper so i could try so yeah i kept this just for your for you guys to see it but this is um also the uh the um watercolors the professional watercolors so now i have two um windsor newton professional watercolors and but this although i got i spend double maybe a couple maybe a little more than double at least um this is uh not a repeat because a is 24 a 24 set and b it was customized by me at least halfway so I got, and these were on sale as well at Jackson's. Um, I got the Ant, Ant Rep Blue, Hooker's Green, um, Potter's Pink. I have Potter's Pink and, um, and Roman Schmalls, but I want to try this one. Mauve uh, Permanent. Uh, Gold Okra. And I think that's my third gold okra. I'm not sure. Perlene violet. There's a lot of violet in here. Um, this is transparent gold deep. Oh, I didn't realize I bought two types of transparent. See another. Um, this Cap Captain Martin violet. I told her there was a lot of violet. <laughs> uh, indigo. Yep, indigo. And, and uh, cobalt violet. Oh, I've been dying. This was the most expensive. It was like $5 and change. Less than 6 but um, definitely 5 something. Because all the other ones were like $4. 4 dollars 4 $4.60. Under $5 except for this one. Uh, green gold. Oh, yeah, I'm excited about that. I've never seen that one. And Naples Yellow Deep. I have Naples Yellow, which I love. And Buff Titanium. I was Buff Titanium. I was I was between this one and Buff Titanium, so I ended up getting the the Naples Yellow Deep. So yeah, that's kind of what I got as the second birthday haul. I hope I didn't bore you guys to death with all my stories and things like that. But yeah, definitely check Jackson's. At um, check it. Uh oh yeah and. On a daily basis if you want to and I, I just put the stuff that you like saved it so this is going to go in here remember this one and this one I didn't show you the professional ones which I'm gonna do it now because I swapped them with the cotton this is no longer cotton mint. Um, it's a uh, professional so this is the ones that I got over Christmas and I swapped it I took off the cotton mint, I gave it away and I put it in the other and the travel set that I gave it away and I kept this and I that's why I got this so on this one I have Windsor lemon catnam free yellow uh, yellow okra catnam catnam free red a lizard and crimson oh permanent sap green damn oh this is hooker's green oh 
Okay, I almost thought I had two. But, I mean, that, having two different greens is good. French Ultramarine, Windsor Blue, Burnt Umber, Burnt Sienna, Paints Gray, and Ivory Black. So, yeah, I'm going to put those in here. And then I'm going to show you guys on the reels. But, yeah, um, what I wanted to say that, yeah, um, that's kind of what I do. I go look around for sales. That, and I like to have good quality stuff now that I, you know, that I educated myself um, with YouTube, thank God, and, you know, all these other uh, YouTube channels, all of you artists, you channels that some of you watch me, because I didn't really, I was new, completely new to the art uh, area, and, um, yeah, and I would hear Jackson's, this and that, and I was like, what is that, what is Jackson, what is Jerry's, like, I had no idea, so I watch a lot of videos, um, uh, and whenever I can, and I still do, I still do, because I, I was, it is a big, big um, uh, science-y type of um, uh, discipline. So, yeah. So, I'm enjoying to buy good quality stuff. But like I said, the only reason I spend more on this because I swapped them and I gave some away, which it's okay because they're Cartman. Um, and I didn't, you know, I this is the second time I gave two Cartmans away. But, um, and like I said, it was more expensive because I customized it. Um, you don't have to do that, but I do suggest you do that because you don't want to have all your watercolors, different sets with the same colors. Cause it's just like, even though they behave different, you still want to have them a little bit different. And, um, you know, you know, and that, that would be nice for you. But anyway, I hope you guys like my, my second part of, uh, of my, um, birthday, uh, haul and i'm really glad i got these things they're good quality stuff stuff that i want and i not necessarily need but um that they would help me around this journey of art and i will continue to do so um you will see a lot of the swatches and even from the brushes um on the on my shorts and you know all week so yeah and i will make a short video with the with the brushes when I do get them on the day that I get them. Okay. You guys have a really good Sunday. Um, watch playoffs if you like sports. If not, then, you know, enjoy yourself and watch a movie or take care of yourself. Bye-bye.